Hello everyone and welcome to the Ingles Table. I'm Abby J and I'm here today to show you how to make my carrot, avocado, and orange salad. I got everything I needed at my Ingles, so let's get started. As you see here, these are beautiful carrots. The awakening of spring, and spring has all the flavors, it's new beginnings, and I love going to Ingles to get these. I normally get them the size of my finger, my pointer finger, because they're tender, they're more tender. If you do get the other carrots, you just need to uh, cook them longer. But what I'm gonna do is leave like a half inch of the stem on these before I put them in the baking dish, like so. Just go like this. And then this one, just a half there. And then we got this. These others here, just put them in like so. And this is a savory dish. This is a savory dish that I love making for the spring holidays, Easter, Mother's Day. You can really make it year round. But what I'm gonna do is um, make a, a little paste. This is the paste I, I make for this. And I start with uh, some chopped garlic. There's about three tablespoons, some ground cumin, and some coriander. Of course, there's some hot chili flakes, chili pepper, and some red pepper flakes, and a little bit of salt, and I got one fourth cup of olive oil. So you wanna mix this all together. Wow, it smells so good. These flavors really bring out the carrots, and uh, you, you can really, Pair this with a lot of different things like chicken, pork, anything like that. So what we're gonna do is cover this paste, get it all in there. And we're gonna, you know, make sure the paste gets all over the carrots. And what I like to do, so this doesn't uh, stick in the oven, I like to put about a half a cup of water in my dish. And what we'll do is bake this uh, at 400 degrees for about an hour, or you might want to check on it to make sure they're tender. So we'll be right back. We're back and we're ready to plate these awesome carrots and they smell so delicious. And we've got a little platter here that I love to plate these on, just like so. This makes about uh, servings for about uh, four. And as I said, you could absolutely do this with any kind of meats. And there we go. I'm gonna do that. And what pairs well with this is avocado citrus. And what I'm gonna do is I'm going to cut this lemon and we want to put some lemon on the avocado that does it, that helps it from turning brown and they have more time to marinate. And then what I like to do is I add the citrus with this and mix this together with a little bit of juice and a little bit of olive oil. So now we're ready to finish this dish. Put some citrus right here. This, all of this avocado on here. And we want to top this with an herb called cilantro. And cilantro will make this so fresh and wonderful. And I know your family's gonna enjoy making this. And Thanks so much for joining me here at the Ingles Table. Be sure to check out the website for more tricks, tips, and recipes. I'll see you next time.